tell you, these are spray lines and or maybe um, spray lines that are being electromagnetically manipulated by radio frequency waves possibly broadcast by the cell phone towers um, and or satellites there is a major tower right there that is basically the US cellular tower over by our Costco near our Costco down there and these are spray lines basically and they're being manipulated by radio frequency transmissions now I have notified all my local representatives and, and uh, Congress person about this um, you would think they would be able to uh, do something about this but they're totally ignoring it for some reason I believe the reason why they're ignoring it is because the particles they use are toxic. Basically these particles will eventually fall to the ground and you and I will inhale them. Our elected officials have signed a non-disclosure agreement saying that they can't talk about this and they're, they're trying to do studies. They, they're trying to do studies basically uh, for black lung disease right now. I hear it uh, very often on the radio. They call it mesothelioma. Basically they're trying to get people who have this disease to try and figure out you know what effect these sprays are having on the public. Um, the reason why your Congress, your representatives don't say anything about this is because basically there's a huge liability um, it violates the Clean Water Act and very, very likely other um, laws. And so your local elected representatives and those in Washington basically are ignoring the issue um, because the um, global elite, the global elite, the people who are pulling the strings, the 300 people basically have the power in the world, the Bilderbergs, the Rothschilds, and all those other um, people who have accumulated the wealth are pulling the strings and part of the spraying program may be the Agenda 21, Agenda 22, where there's a, um, a motive to reduce the population to control greenhouse gases to a degree. Now, some people believe that the cities, states that do not comply with the reduction of greenhouse gases, they are uh, given these storms. Basically these storms, storms are created, dry, droughts, floods, etc. are created by these people who manipulate the weather. The military industrial complex is probably 20 or 30 years ahead of what the public knows about and they don't want the public to know about it. And that's why they tell you the whole chemtrail issue is a hoax, but it's really called weather modification, solar radiation management, uh, marine cloud whitening, etc. So it's that's the story, and it's all about control, controlling your environment, controlling your weather um, covertly for profit and gain the gain to control you, uh, the profit to control the commodities market, the insurance market, etc. And that's the way I see it.